Hi again, this is Pastor Jeff from Community Covenant Church with a few minutes of encouragement from God's Word. Today we're in the Gospel of John, chapter 12, verse 26. And Jesus is talking to his uh, followers and he says, Anyone who wants to serve me must follow me, because my servants must be where I am, and the Father will honor anyone who serves me. You know, sometimes I think about what it might have been like to be one of Jesus' disciples when he was on earth 2,000 years ago. Following Jesus was a pretty obvious and uh, fairly straightforward thing. You know, Jesus is going there. I'm going where Jesus is going. He's, he's stopping. This is where I'm stopping too. I just, I'm following. There he is, and I'm going where he is. Now, it's not as, uh, as clear, perhaps is maybe you, you feel a little challenged. Like, oh, how do I follow Jesus? I mean, I don't, he's not walking around that I can follow. Jesus, however, is now residing within us if we have given ourselves to him. If we've experienced salvation and, and welcomed him in to take control as king of our life. He is within us in the form of the Holy Spirit. Following him is now following his guidance and his direction. We go through our day seeking to be in tune with Jesus. What is going on? What are you up to around me? What opportunities are you going to open in my day to have a conversation with someone, to help somebody else out, to go somewhere that you place on my heart? Following Jesus is more about being in tune to him for you and I, to Honestly say, Jesus, speak and guide me and help me to go where you want me to go to do and say what you'd like me to do and say. That's when I can be following him. It's a little different, but it's the same concept and maybe even better than what the disciples have because we have him within us guiding and directing our thoughts and our words and our actions if we are willing to. Let's pray. Jesus, thank you for your presence within us, and thank you that you will guide and direct us as we open ourselves with the desire to know what you want us to say and do and where to go. And it's a dynamic relationship. It's exciting because it's an adventure each and every day of where are you up to something and how do you want to use me? Lord, I pray that each of us would choose to have that open attitude of saying, I want to be used by you today, Jesus. So let me see where you want me to go and to act according to your Spirit's guiding from within. And thank you that you empower us, not just pointing where we should go, but you're also going with us and helping us to be your person in that place. We ask this all in Jesus' name. Amen. So again, in John chapter 12, verse 26, Jesus says, Anyone who wants to serve me must follow me, because my servants must be where I am, and the Father will honor anyone who serves me. I'm looking forward to being honored by my willingness to serve Jesus and to follow him. Take care and have a good day.